What would you do if your company was once worth $47 billion, but now it's on the verge of bankruptcy? That's the situation that WeWork, the troubled office sharing firm, is facing right now. According to U.S. media reports, WeWork plans to file for bankruptcy as early as next week. The company has been struggling with a huge debt pile and mammoth losses since its failed attempt to go public in 2019. Its co-founder and former CEO, Adam Newman, was forced to step down amid scrutiny of his leadership and lavish lifestyle. The pandemic also hit the company hard, as social distancing rules drove people to work from home. WeWork's shares plunged by more than 40% on Tuesday after the bankruptcy news broke. The company declined to comment on what it called speculation. WeWork has been trying to restructure its business and cut costs, but it still faces challenges such as softer demand and a difficult operating environment. It has also seen the exit of several top executives this year, including its former chief executive and chairman, Sandeep Mithrani. WeWork has more than 700 locations in 39 countries around the world, but its future is uncertain. Will it be able to survive the bankruptcy process and turn around its fortunes? Or will it become another cautionary tale of the startup boom and bust? For more details on this story, visit BBC News or Bloomberg. And for more news and updates, stay tuned to this channel.